today we are discussing about muscular cutaneous nerve muscular cutaneous nerve is a branch of lateral cord of brachial plexus this is a lateral cord we know that the lateral cord gives us a, gives out a branch known as the lateral pectoral nerve after giving out the lateral pectoral nerve the lateral cord of brachial plexus continues as a muscular cutaneous nerve uh, as the lateral cord is formed from the anterior division of the upper and middle trunk the root value of muscular cutaneous nerve is root value is C5, C6, C7. Now the branches of muscular cutaneous nerve. Muscular cutaneous nerve arising as a branch of the lateral cord of brachial plexus it supplies muscle that is the coracobrachialis muscle coracobrachialis which is originating from the coracoid process getting out inserted into the humerus so the nerve supplies this muscle that is the coracobrachialis and it also supplies the biceps muscle and the part of brachialis and after supplying this muscle the nerve continues as the lateral cutaneous nerve of the forearm continuation of this nerve is the lateral cutaneous nerve of forearm So this is a sensory branch of muscular cutaneous nerve that is the lateral cutaneous nerve of forearm. We know that the biceps and the brachialis muscle are the flexors of the elbow. What happens when this muscular cutaneous nerve is injured? The flexion at the elbow is affected. Next, sensation of a lateral aspect of forearm is gone. Next. <coughs> The biceps gel
if absent. So these are the features of injury to the muscular cutaneous nerve. The flexion at the elbow is not possible and the sensation over the lateral aspect of forearm is lost and bicep jerk is lost. Bicep jerk is absent. These are the features of muscular cutaneous nerve injury. That's all about muscular cutaneous nerve. To see more videos from our channel, please subscribe our channel. Thank you.